And tonight, trouble at Jaguars, and this time it stripped the business of a majority of its employees. They were all arrested. It centers around an expired permit. Jonathan Palasek is on the story tonight. Jonathan, what's with this permit? Hey Tatum, so 18 people in total were arrested last weekend. You can see them all right here behind me, all employees of Jaguars. In order for this establishment to stay open, well, they must have a permit. Odessa police showed up for an inspection and found their permit was expired, and they were still operating as a sexually oriented activity business. Now, according to the police department, management at Jaguars had been told several times in writing that they were required to get and maintain a business license over the last two years, among other requirements listed in the city's ordinance for this type of business. Well, back in April of this year, the Jaguars permit to operate as a sexually oriented business it expired. Jaguar staff members and written letters provided by Jaguar's council representing their business stated that Jaguar's was voluntarily operating as a bikini bar and therefore not classified as a sexually oriented business, meaning they did not have to renew their permit. However, police received information that Jaguar's was not actually operating as a quote bikini bar. Police then performed an undercover operation and found several of the employees conducting business that requires the sexually oriented business license. In total, 18 people were arrested for violations, including no sexually oriented business permit, solicitation for prostitution, among others. Now those charges, by the way, they are class A misdemeanors and they're punishable up to a year in jail and uh, or and or a, a thousand dollar fine. Now I did reach out to the management group who owns Jaguars here in Odessa, but they have yet to get back to me with a comment. Tatum.